What's up? What's up, YouTube? What up, everyone? Uh, I am back from jail. Uh, it feels amazing. It true, it true, it truthfully does. Uh, I basically got out of jail like a week ago. Unfortunately, I couldn't make any videos since then because uh, I've been just so busy and everything, catching up on everything. Uh, yeah, I did a year in jail and now I'm free. It feels fucking amazing. And yeah, guys, this is the bike that was in the big accident. Yeah, this is how it looks right now. Pretty destroyed. Look at that. Yeah, it's pretty bad. No worries. I have the other motorcycle on the other side of the garage. So, uh, so first thing, uh, actually, I'm about to start riding right now. One sec, I got the Harley Davidson right here still. Oh, yeah. Let me open the garage real quick. If this bitch can work, there we go. Oh, shit, it is snowing in a motherfucker right now. But look at this Challenger, though. Baby blue. Yeah, guys, uh, it just feels so great to be home. Uh, basically, let me tell you guys the story what happened. <sighs> basically, I had a 90-day bid, right? It was, they called it boot camp. And then uh, I got in a really big fight. So that 90 day bid that I was supposed to do, they made it They made it turn into a year. Well, I made it turn into a year, but still. Uh, then I went to prison for like two, three months and then some other shit popped up. Then uh, they took me back to the county jail. Then I did the rest of my time in, in Macomb County Jail. I know it sucks and everything, but it did fly by so quick though. And I hope that would never go back. And I'm sure the police, the, the police department, you know, in Sterling Heights is watching this video too right now. But more videos is to come. More videos is to come if you guys like it or not. So, uh, yeah. And I'm going to show you guys the other motorcycle in the other garage. So, we're about to go there right now. All right, guys. Uh, I'm in the other side of the garage. All right, guys, this this bike I have right now that is completely alive, not like the other bike I have. Fuck, look at it. Look where it's at, it's right there. No way, all this bullshit around it. In a year, a lot can change, big time. So what I gotta do is move all this bullshit, all of it, move it aside and so I can take this bike out and transfer this bike to over there on the other side of the garage. So I'm gonna try it right now, actually. Once I'm gonna put the camera right here. And we're gonna do this. We are gonna do this right now. Alright guys, we are about to start moving this beast. Damn, I missed her so much! I haven't seen her in like a year! Alright guys, it's like really bad out there too, so I'm still gonna... Fuck, I still gotta move this thing right here. Fuck. What do my people do? Alright guys. That this is such a good idea, I'll tell you the truth. I'm with sandals right now and everything. Ugh. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Hello again to all my friends, take
Together we can play some rock and roll. Flow again to all my friends. Together we can play some rock and roll. Flow again to all my friends. Together we can play some rock and roll. Flow again to all my friends. Together we can play some rock and roll. Flow again to all my friends. Together we can play some rock and roll. 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 Oh my god, guys, look at it. This is the bike that was in that big accident. Like, this thing got destroyed. It was funny because uh, the police actually wanted to convict it, but my people and everything while I was in jail, uh, they, you know, they got my lawyer and everything and they went over there and grabbed it for me really quick. I mean, even though I really can't do nothing with it, this thing is completely total, totaled, but it brings it brings memories though, you know what I mean? Yeah man, this shit's crazy. Yeah, crazy. I also gotta tell you guys something too. Uh they did make me do 90 days tether also. One sec. So basically I can't go places without permission and shit like that. I mean, it's just like regular, uh, you know, recommendations for it, but, but it's going to be all right, though. You know, 90 days when the spring comes, I'm going to be off of it. I'm going to be making cool-ass videos. I mean, jail, jail wasn't fun or anything, but, you know what I mean? But, I, you know, I had those fun moments like fucking cook-ups and fucking my, my 21st birthday was in there, too. So I was like, fuck it. We were all making fucking, what was that shit called? Um... A spud juice is called, and it's like fucking getting a lot of fruit and everything, putting in a, like some type of bag and closing it and making that bitch age, and it turns into alcohol, like legit. <laughs> so yeah, that's what we did on my birthday, on my 21st birthday in there. Uh, we just all got, I don't know, it was funny, man. It was funny, but it's a place that I never want to be, like go back, you know what I mean? Because that place is just fucking sucks. It does. It was so funny because the day, the day, um, they called me to go home. Like they, the police officer went to my bunk and tapped my bunk. He's like, Mo Dottini, you ready to go home? He actually called me that by that name too. It was funny. Then I was like, yeah. So I got all of my books, all of my paperwork and everything. And yeah, freaking literally just walked out that bitch. And it was funny because uh, I, I told the officer right when I went through the doors, like these big ass metal doors. I'm like, officer, am I like good to go? Like, uh, just because I'm not trying to get in trouble again, trying to ca catch some kind of escape charge, you know what I mean? It just went through my mind. The officer was like, shoo, shoo, you're free. I'm like, just like that? He's like, yeah, you're good, deuces. So I was like, holy shit, this is not the day. So next thing you know, fucking, there was, right when I went through that metal door and everything, bro, there was like fucking water fountains and fucking uh, vending machines. I wasn't, I wasn't like too used to that shit. And fucking, I was like, damn, that's crazy. So what the first thing I did was my people wasn't there yet. So there was a gas station like across the street. Oh my God, I never ran so much more faster in my life. Like till, till that moment, like I ran over there. I bought myself a Mountain Dew, bought, bought myself a pack of cigarettes. Uh, yeah, it was crazy, man. It really was the, the jail. I don't know, man, it was, it was, it was crazy.
but yeah, you know, it just feel, it feels great to be back home to my family, to my friends and everything. Um, yeah, it's, it's very, very fucking emotional, actually. You know what I mean? But yeah, I'm, I'm out. I can't wait. Wow! <laughs> but no, it feels great, though. Um, yeah, hopefully never, never again. I mean, am I going to, the big question is, am I ever going to run again from the police? Uh, I don't know, but we'll see. <laughs> but uh, if I do do something like that, I'm not going to wipe out like to a fucking minivan. You know what I mean? But yeah, that's that's the story, guys. Uh, I don't think I missed anything, did I? No, I don't think I did. But uh, yeah, but the time did did fly. You know what I mean? I remember the first day I was in there, like when I was at boot camp. I'm like, I'm never going home. But it fucking did. It came. The day came for me, and that's it. You know. So yeah. So that's my story, guys. Uh, uh, message from from me to you guys is. Don't get in trouble <laughs> because you guys ain't going to like that place. It was garbage. And yeah, never again. Like I always said, never, never, ever, ever again. Fuck that shit. So yeah. So these are the bikes, guys. Uh, this bike will be missed. Honestly, it tr truthfully will. Um, I don't know if I, if, like, I can fix this bike to, to make it into a stunt bike. Just like a full, straight up stunt bike. You know what I mean? The engine looks good and everything. But the last time, like, I don't know, there was a lot of oil dripping from it. Every, I, I still can't believe I got this bike in my garage right now. It, it's crazy. It truthfully is. All right, guys, I'm talking way too much. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. I am going to be posting a lot now. I know it's, like, fucking snowy outside and everything. And people might ask, how, like, how are you going to make videos? But I will. I'll surprise you guys. I always do.